Hello and welcome to my course on Milwaukee Battery Repair. I've been repairing these for a couple of years and I'm going to show you some of the diagnostic and repair techniques I picked up along the way. So if you have a few faulty batteries or just want the greater knowledge of battery technology, specifically Milwaukee in this case, this course is for you. Episode 5, resetting your battery if it's got a flashing light. This battery is a single flashing light but it's shown 18 volts, which is well in the chargeable range of voltage. What happened with this battery is I replaced cells and the board has not reset. So if I put it in the charger, for example, even though it's shown 18 volts and the cells are well balanced, it's showing a green light as if it's charged. Sometimes it's as simple as putting it in a tool like this here and just pulling the trigger. Sometimes. But not in this case. Well, we'll try in the charger, that might work. No, that didn't work. As you can see, that didn't work. Um, so we'll try something else. You can take these two terminals here, these two, and connect them together for a few seconds. You can see that's, um, you don't have to take the top off. It's just these two, the minus and the one beside it. You can do that and then you can do the same again, put the drill on and sometimes that works, sometimes it doesn't, in this case it doesn't. Other people have told me holding down this button for a period of time can work. So we'll try that. And no, that doesn't work. So that's all the techniques that I have to reset a battery. If you replace the cells and the board doesn't reset. With all those uh, techniques attempted and failed, our only choice is to replace the circuit board, which um, we'll do in the next episode. So tune in for that.